What are you doing, Gaz? Hey, Gaz is gaming, PC gaming. We're playing some ghosts and DJs. Hey, yes, mate. What is up, guys? Gaz is super excited because I was given a little preview demo. I was given the early access code to be one of the first people to check out Ghosts and DJs, this fantastic new game by Dr. Cucho, featuring soundtracks by Dead Mouse. Amazing. Guys, the soundtrack is just sick. Um, I'm gonna show you in some of the gameplay. It is just an absolute banger. Proper awesome retro gameplay style of something like Ghosts and Goblins. One of those classic retro games developed by a great indie developer at Dr. Coop Show. And man, have they done a fantastic job with the graphics and the gameplay. Let's check it out right now. Who loves games? Yes, man. So this game is absolutely awesome. It is a little bit of fun. It's having a little bit of a laugh at some of these new upcoming DJs in the world that can just get on the decks, pay other people to help them out with their projects, and Dr. Cucho ain't having any of that at all. So it's a real retro gameplay style. It really is like Ghosts and Goblins. I love the whole side scrolling, throwing items at your enemies, whether it's discs, or CDs. It's got platforming in it too, and the platforming was really interesting because I'm quite new to PC gaming, so I had to work it out really quickly what was fire, what was jump, and just really enjoyed playing through the first few levels at the moment to make this video, just to show you guys a little bit of what it's really about. It does get quite hard at times, it does get intense, but it's really quirky, it's got some great humor included as well, just like this moment. Now this game is released free to play and encourages for a charitable donation. You can use the help the children button in the main menu of the game. Also from the main menu you can go down to the in-game music and you can select between the orchestral version by Dr. Cucho or you can use the tracks also by Dead Mouse. You've got the option, it's up to you. I am loving the banging vibe that Dead Mouse brings to the game, it is amazing. So weapon choices are a little bit like Ghost and Goblins as well, wherever you're using these kind of objects you can throw, you can launch them down at an angle which sometimes has an advantage to get into those hard to reach areas. Some of the other projectiles are straight and diagonal, they can be more precise for a long distance lob, however sometimes it's just harder to get the projectile down where you need it to be. Now, the first time I played the game, I didn't see it at all, but there we go, we got the Dead Mouse Mask. It actually took me to about my fourth playthrough to actually unlock this ability. So you fire your normal projectiles, but you also get the little rainbow cat that flies out and attacks things. And it's really useful sometimes for climbing different areas in the game and sometimes hitting some of those enemies that might have been really hard to get to. The game continues to have really good humor throughout and does present more challenges with the way you've got to jump and attack and try to keep your energy bar full. I found it took me a few goes to get into it. Absolutely loving it, great job. I'm gonna play some more. I'm super hyped guys to be reached out to and chosen to bring some gameplay to YouTube and to be one of the first people to do that. So if there's any other companies out there, if you want me to rep your game, if you want me to play that, test it, Check it out and deliver some gaming news on that to the world of YouTube. Hit me up guys, Gaz Loves Games or gazlovesgames at hotmail.com and it would be good to talk to you. I look forward to hearing from you.